Hey guys, in this video I'm going to be walking you through how to change the Wi-Fi internet settings on your Chromecast. There's actually a number of steps that we need to walk through. They don't make it super simple, but you should be able to accomplish your goals here by following this step-by-step -step tutorial. So I'm going to assume you already have the Google Home application. If you've run your Chromecast prior, it should look something like this. So what we're going to do is launch the Google Home application. And that'll take you to the home page of the Google Home app, and then you have to find your Chromecast device. For me, it's located in the living room and it's the living room TV. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that. And then once I'm on this page, I need to click the little gear settings in the upper right hand corner, this little guy right here. So I'm going to open up that. And then that takes us to the device settings and about halfway down, you can see what Wi-Fi router that you're hooked into and whether you're changing the password of your current Wi-Fi router or switching to a new one. Either way, you're going to have to forget this network and then reset up your Chromecast. So that's what I'm going to walk you through here, clicking on the Wi-Fi area. And then it says, are you sure you want to forget this network? And again, make sure that you want to do this because once this is done, then we have to walk through the steps of resetting up that Chromecast, which will take a little bit of time. So I'm going to go ahead and click forget network. And then that boots us back to the home page of the Google Home application. So at this point, just drag down the screen all the way until you get the little refresh thing showing up there right below where it says home and then let go of the screen so that your Google Home application can refresh itself. So for me, I had to pull down and refresh this page a few times before it finally said set up one device. That's going to be the Chromecast that we are setting up at this point, and it should be right at the top of the home page of the Google Home application. So I'm going to go ahead and click on set up one device, and then you're going to choose a home that the Chromecast is located in and click next. And then it will look for devices for a little bit of time. So then it's going to have nearby devices that you can hook up here and there Chromecast does show itself. So we're going to go ahead and click on Chromecast living room TV and then click on next. And then it is connecting to Chromecast. This will take again a little bit of time and then it says it's connected. And then it's going to ask you if the code that you currently see on your phone is the same one that you see on your television that's being put out there by your Chromecast. So just make sure that those line up and then go ahead and click yes. And then agree to the illegal terms. And then if you want to help improve Chromecast or not, you can make that decision for yourself. And then at this point, you can finally select which Wi-Fi connection that you want to hook into and whether you're just changing the password of your current Wi-Fi connection or switching over to another one. So I'm going to stick with the same one here, 10 to 22, and then click next. And then it's going to connect you to that Wi-Fi connection. And then finally, it says that it is connected and you can choose where the device is located. For me, that's going to be my living room and then click next. And then if you want, at this point, you can link your Chromecast to your Google account. I'm going to just skip this for now. You can also set up your Google Assistant with your Chromecast. I'm going to click next. You can link radio services. I'm going to do not now. You can link video services. Again, I'm going to skip that. You can link TV services. Again, I'm going to skip that. And finally, it says we are all done. We're hooked up with our Chromecast in our living room, hooked in to that Wi-Fi connection. So I'm going to go ahead and click continue. And at this point, setup should be complete. So again, guys, it's a rather involved process, but if you follow this step-by-step -step tutorial, you should be able to change or switch up the needed Wi-Fi settings to get your Chromecast working. Again, I hope that this video was helpful. I appreciate you stopping by. Consider subscribing to my YouTube channel, and I'll see you guys back here for future videos.